you're still trying to get there because you think your movie needs a final scene where you get to meet half and shake his hand. Well, I think it would be a great ending because really, how, probably how many guys have thought of, like, they've wanted to go to the mansion, but they just, like, how do you get there? How does a normal guy get there? How you doing? My name's Dave Renier. I'm 29 years old. And as far back as I can remember, I always wondered, how does an average guy get invited to the Playboy Mansion? Good luck, Dave, on your quest! Just touch me. <laughs> Hopefully I do this interview, he'll hear about this, this guy will hear about this, he'll hear about this, and I'll basically get back to Playboy. This is it. We're gonna go to the Playboy office here in New York. On our way to JFK. Yeah, we're from Los Angeles. We just got to LA. We're on Hollywood Boulevard right now. Where are we? Uh, we're in uh, we're in Memphis. We're gonna meet Brian. You know, it's it's a roller coaster. Yeah. Um, and just you gotta believe in yourself and believe enough in the journey to do it. I don't even really know if I should even introduce the person that is sitting next to me this time. Um, Adult film star, reality film star, normal film star, like just a normal everyday. I'll take, I'll take all the above. Yeah. No one's gonna believe it's really me anyway. They're gonna say, is that my Jeremy working at working at Dumbbell? <laughs> you know I'm trying to get into into the Playboy Mansion to meet you out there. And oh I, yeah, good luck. <laughs> Let me ask you a question. You've been there. Yeah, many times. What was your first reaction the first time you ever went there? Like it's a, I saved the matchbooks. This is Playboy Mansion in West really? Yeah, they have a big bowl of matches. He knows that people like to do that, you know? It's fascinating because you're like, you're like a kid. You know, it's like, I'm at the Playboy Mansion. Nothing else has that mystique, you know? Like, you know? You wouldn't, you know, even though I'm sure Brad Pitt is very famous, of course, no one's gonna go, I'm at Brad Pitt's home. Right. Well, yeah, I'd say that too. But <laughs> We're waiting for Carrot Top to call. Oh my God. It's him. Dave speaking. Hey Dave, this is Caretop. Hey Caretop, how you doing? I'm awesome, how are you doing? I'm doing okay. I appreciate you doing this so much. What kind of advice do you have for me? So like when I do get in, what, what, what should I do? I would run right up the stairs and start looting. That's it? <laughs> Just steal, <laughs> steal as much stuff as I can in the Playboy Mansion? I appreciate it again Caretop, thanks a lot. No problem Dave, we'll see you, we'll see you soon. If you were in my shoes, right. what do you think my first question to you should be? Well, the first thing you should say is trolley that you're a fan. Well, obviously, yeah. I appreciate that. I guess what I would do, in the interest of time, knowing that he's a busy guy, I'd probably just walk up and say, Mr. Hefner, thanks for the boobs. <laughs> That's it? Yes. <laughs> and then you say, like, peace out. Peace out. Yeah. <laughs> What's that there? Jeans and maybe, like, a shirt. If I go for the handshake, what type of handshake should I go for? Because I could mess it up and do one of these ones. Don't want to give him the cold fish. You know what I mean? I don't want to necessarily give him that death. Yeah, I don't want to break his hand up, but he right. might. He might have something like he might. You know what I mean? Like have like this. Yeah, something. he might have something like. Maybe I you don't just know. give him a death, You know, like just this. a little one. Just something like just, that. Yeah, that'd be. So celebrities and musicians and and, and 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 wrestlers and sports athletes and stuff, they get in. How does a normal guy get in? Well, you don't want to go to the Playboy Mansion as a normal guy. I know. You want to you want to be unique. You want the girls. You want the hot babes, the playmates. You want them to. Uh, you know, to single you out, you want to stand out in their eyes. So you gotta, once you get in there, uh, you've gotta be not normal. Right. But the problem is getting in. Be yourself. Be funny. Don't be cheesy. No cheese. <laughs> they won't have nachos for my cheese. Like, no, they won't. No. You can't with one girl. I know okay, that. Nachos with one. You gotta have two girlfriends at least. But now people know how hard it is for the quest I'm doing. Murder. Yeah. Murder. I, I, your odds are not very good. I know that. Yeah, because like you know, I know if you're uh, if you're related to Steven Spielberg, you have a much better shot. That's you're a very nice guy. I feel like you're from Canada. You know, but again, it's if you can get into the mansion, I'll be very impressed. If you have one last piece of advice to give me, if you can't get in as a guy, try getting in as a girl. We're at the front gate of the Playboy Mansion. This is it right here. This address: ten two three six. Uh, Charing Cross Road. Just gotta get beyond this gate, dude. Hey, Caretop. 
approves you and says, all right, I'm going to meet with this guy and let him rap this movie, uh, then you have permission to come by and hang with us first. Oh, that's perfect. You guys, maybe you guys can help me out a little bit. Well, this is helping me out a lot, actually, so I appreciate it a lot. I'm, I'm trying to help out every other guy out there, too, and just to let them know that this can happen. So, but oh, I, you're so sweet. Everyone's got dreams. And yours is uh, clearly in the, in either the back or the front of every guy's mind. How do I get to the Playboy Mansion and right. make it happen? And uh, we wish the best. Keep, keep us, as always, keep us updated, Dave. And I appreciate it, guys. Thank you very much. All right. Bye, guys. Go to mydatewithhugh.com if you want updates on the Dave Renier Project. Please. The guy. Hey, thanks, Dave. No problem, Tim. Thanks a lot. All right, bye. See ya.